baptized based on Matthew chapter 3 and Luke chapter 3 verses 1 through 22. John, the son of Zechariah and Elizabeth, grows up with God's call on his heart. As an adult, he meditates in the desert, and there he hears God calling him. He begins preaching forcefully all around the Jordan River. Stop sinning, be baptized. God's kingdom is very near. Dressed in camel hair and eating nothing but locusts and whatever honey he can scrounge from wild bees, John doesn't have a lot of patience for people who live in luxury and ignore God. John reminds people what the scriptures say in the book of Isaiah. A messenger is calling out from the desert. Prepare the way of the Lord. Soon, all of you will see God's salvation with your own eyes. News spreads far and wide about the man who looks and speaks like a prophet. Curious crowds come out to hear John the Baptist, some assume he's talking about other people's sins. Do you think that just because you are Jews, you will be allowed in God's kingdom? You must repent first. If you have extra clothes, share with someone who has none. If you have extra food, give it away. Scoffers turn away, but many people listen carefully. They wonder if John might be more than a simple prophet. Are you the savior God has promised us? No, I baptize with water, but he will baptize with the Holy Spirit. Get ready, the Savior is coming. John doesn't know it, but the Savior is in the crowd one day. Jesus has come down from Nazareth to hear John speak, and he asks to be baptized. Why do you come to me to be baptized? I'm the one who needs to be baptized by you. John, God chose you to introduce me to the world. So John baptizes Jesus, and when Jesus comes up out of the water, the Spirit of God descends in the shape of a dove. You are my beloved son. I am so proud of you. <laughs>